Hi, I'm John Lincoln with Ignite Visibility, and today I'm gonna to give you 10 tips for starting a new website. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is get the right domain name. Try to keep it short, try to get a .com, try to do something that really relates specifically to your brand. Don't get any dashes, you're gonna be in better shape. Okay, item number two, make sure you launch on HTTPS. That means that it's gonna be a secure site. Google's favoring that nowadays and many other websites as well. So make sure that you launch the website secure. Okay, item number three, install your tracking code. So you're gonna to wanna to set up Google Analytics and you're gonna to wanna to set up Google Search Console and Bing Search Console at a minimum. So make sure you install those three things. Okay, item number four, create a keyword strategy and optimize your top pages. Now you can learn a lot about this inside of our YouTube video playlist on SEO on the Ignite Visibility YouTube channel. But basically you're gonna to wanna to go into a tool like the Google Keyword Planner or a tool like SEMrush and you're gonna to wanna to find your top terms and optimize those web pages on your site so that they can kinda of get a good base and potentially start getting considered to rank for some of the terms you wanna rank for. Okay, item number five, pick the social media networks where your communities are gonna be and build communities and profiles there. Make sure that those profiles match your brand and match your domain name so that you're in a good spot and everything kind of relates well to each other. Okay, item number six, connect your social media profiles to your website and your website to your social media profiles. So make sure that you have icons that link to your social media profiles and then on your social media profiles, make sure you link from your social media profiles to your website. Okay, item number seven, set up a blog. Yes, I think everybody should set up a blog and you should check out the other video I did on how to create a blog that your industry loves, which is on the Ignite Visibility YouTube channel. But set up a blog, it's going to be a very important central area where you can add information on anything you want to your website. And you can also, of course, do content marketing, which is an amazing way to generate traffic, leads, sales, capture emails and whatnot online. Okay, number eight, set up an email capture system. So that can be just a basic newsletter subscribe that's in the sidebar or the footer, or that can be firing pop-ups through a third-party tool like Sumo, for example. Uh, that tool will allow you to have pop-ups that you can deliver for specific pages and specific um, websites that people come to to that page, and you can get them into some type of funnel or you can capture their email address. Okay, so now you're kind of up and running a little bit. So item number nine, you wanna create an ad strategy. And at that point, you're going to be looking to run ads on social media. You'll also be looking to run ads on places like Google AdWords or the Google Display Network. Create an ad strategy for where your specific demographic is looking for you online so that you can start generating traffic back to your website for people who could potentially convert for your product or your service. Item number 10, create an email marketing strategy. And you may wanna check out another video I've done on how to do email marketing to become an influencer. There's a lot of different ways to do email marketing. You can do it um, so that you can become a thought leader, you can do it for e-commerce, you can do it for lead generation. Um, and so regardless, you're gonna to wanna to have an email marketing strategy that relates to your goals for the website. Okay, so those are my top 10 things when it comes to launching a new website. Of course, there's a lot more that goes into it. I couldn't go over every single thing in this video. You know, you wanna have great branding. You wanna be doing conversion rate optimization. You wanna be reviewing your analytics. Um, I could go on. Um, so make sure that you do these 10 things. And then if you have any questions, you can feel free to comment inside of the YouTube video. And there's always a lot more to learn out there and a lot more to have an ongoing marketing strategy so check back to the Ignite Visibility YouTube channel or check out our blog if you'd like to learn more. Have a great day.